What is up guys? It's The Real Deal. Welcome to the channel. Guys, we're playing Eternal Evolution again. And today we're going to be talking about evolving our heroes. This is one of the most important things that we can do in the game. This is going to give us huge stat bonuses to our heroes. Um, but also we can start to get exclusives when we get to a certain level. And we're getting 16% attack bonus, 13% crit damage. And then we're also getting some damage reduction, 13% as well, which is great. I mean, Carmor is a damage dealer, but that damage reduction is going to help give us extra survivability as well. So it is really, really important. And also we're going to get buffs to our abilities as well. So this is just like huge stuff going on. And yeah, it's just going to help you progress further in the game. So really, really important that we do this properly. So first thing we're going to be looking at, we're going to be uh, boosting... Anpu, he's a triple S champion and I cannot wait to buff him up. But just before we do that, let's just go back a step. Let's, yeah. So I'm just hot tip, a hot tip for you guys. We are not feeding any of these elites right here. But we scroll down, we get our basic heroes. So what we've done here is we've gotten rare champions and we've empowered them into like purples, which they are elites, but they're not. Um, so if we just do like a quick evolve, you can see here it's turning rares into higher up rares. And then if we do intelligent evolve, it's changing these like upgraded rares into elites. So they've all been like boosted now. So we're getting a whole bunch of food now. And just before we boost Anpu, um, I'm just going to sort of use this to try and explain it even better to you guys. So it starts off, we've got an elite, then we can use any elite to boost them and this includes those basic heroes that we've just upgraded so anyone can be used to to be as used as food then we become an elite plus one then we need a dupe copy of our elite then we become an epic and then we can do again any elite and it just so on and so forth so i think it's pretty clear with the guide right here so let's do anpu and hopefully you guys can sort of see it and get a better understanding. But yeah, this guy is going to be an absolute hard carry for the count. And a hard, like not just a hard carry, but like just a real beast. Uh, so here we need two star and it needs to be the same faction as well. So it looks like we don't actually have anyone. So that's fine. We need to just set that up. So go back to Demis, 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 click Evolve. And we've lost him. We have lost Anpu, which is very, there he is. Okay, so he's part of this faction. So if we just click here, we can scroll down and we just need to basically upgrade a Haemon. So upgrading that hot Haemon, and then we need to upgrade him again. And there we go. That's all we were after was a two-star one of these. And I think we're probably going to have to do that again because I've got a few copies of him. So just preparing our food. There we go. And you want to you want to do this as soon as you can because as soon as you do this, you are going to buff like your heroes, you just massively progress into the game. So now we're legendary and then we need an SS copy of Anpu which we have. And I managed to get these from some events that were happening. Um so quite lucky to have so many copies of a triple SS champion already in the game and we're only two weeks into the account. And so we need one more double S. So let's scroll down again. Get that Haemon, grab another one, boost him up, and then we're gonna boost him again. And there we go. And nice. So let's just see, where are we? Because I'm sort of, oh, sorry, we were mythic and now we're legendary. Okay, okay. So I'm still getting used to this game. Like um, in other games I play, it's kind of the other way around, but that's fine. So m mythic is usually above legendary, but it is what it is. It's cool, it's cool. And look at that. He is now um, legendary. 
let's see. I don't know if we've got the weapon just yet. Uh, yes, we've got his exclusive. I mean, huge, just, yeah, this is just massive. And we're just going to forge that up for him. Uh, we've run out of, <laughs> we can't buffer any further than that. But yeah, so it, this is how you evolve heroes. And yeah, it's just the best thing to do in the game. You want to try and get people to like legendary as soon as you can. It just massively, they're just like the damage and the progression. You will just speed things up so much quicker. And then we want to try and get to Immortal as well. So it goes epic. <laughs> Yellow is epic. Mythic is red. Legendary is sort of white. But then we go back to sort of yellow again for Immortal. I guess it's slightly different. But um, yeah, it is what it is. But yeah, I hope this guide helps you guys. Uh, please leave me a cheeky thumbs up. Make sure to smash, smash, smash that subscribe. And I'll catch you all in a video soon. Peace.